There's a few good things uh, getting fired from your regular work. Uh, one of them is that you get a shitload of free time. And right now I am gonna play with uh, a feature on my Blackmagic camera I haven't played with before. It is uh, time lapse, time lapse photography. I know I'm a newbie at that, but I haven't played with it at all, not even on the DSLR. So, the sun is setting, it's about to set, and uh, I'm gonna try to get uh, as a nice view as possible with this little experiment of mine. So I'll get back to you soon, as soon as I park the car somewhere down there. Alright, I found a good spot. Uh, See if you can see. There's the bridge. We're gonna go out and look at a really nice spot to put the camera. And uh, the time lapse is gonna be like two hours, I think. So I'm gonna sit here and probably watch Facebook a lot. So I got this nice little app here that says that the sunset is about 15.32 What is that? Uh, half past 4 or 3? I have no idea 15.32 And time is now 14.31 So in one hour So I'm actually thinking of pressing record now it, uh, the, the camera will take about 5 No, uh, it, it take one image each five, uh, fifth se second, and uh, it will do so for an hour. So I'll be back. Oh my god, I need to wash my car. Time moves so slow. 15 more minutes and it's almost dark. There's a lot of pigeons here. Um, a lot of pigeons. Let's see if we can approach them. See if I can at the same time take a nice uh, still photo of it all, if in case the time lapse goes really bad. Sun hasn't set quite yet. The camera's been off like uh, one and a half hour, and uh, I'm getting home now because I'm freezing my butt off.
So check out the image that I also took. This time-lapse experiment um, was just a little thing I wanted to do today because I had nothing else to do. And uh, it's going to be interesting to see if it works because I never played with this before with this camera. Thanks for watching.